Okay. So the question that you asked me is why do we give flax to our cattle? There's direct evidence that shows that flax given to cattle increase the omega-3 in the marbling portion of their meat. Cattle have two kinds of meat, and I won't bore you with that. It's uh, two kinds of fat, I'm sorry. The, they have the fat that's the marbling, as you know it, and then they have the outside fat. Flax and similar products, and a lot of the range plants that are similar, promote omega-3 in the marbling. Marbling already has omega-3, but it seems that it increases omega-3, and I'm looking forward, I think in the next six months to a year or two, this is going to be a big news flash, uh, how much omega-3 there is in, in marbled beef. We've been telling, I've been telling my patients for years, eat the lean stuff, get the lean stuff. Uh, it just isn't so. Get the marbled stuff. Don't eat the fat around the outside that's for flavoring. Uh, after you've grilled your steak, you cut that off and throw it away. That's probably not healthy. Uh, but the marbling stuff is very good for you. By the use of flax, which by the way is a little bit expensive, uh, but by using flax in our cattle, I believe we're increasing the omega-3 of the marbling. Uh, there's experiments out with this, and that's, they're leaning towards that's probably correct. Um, if nothing else, I feel better doing it. At least we've had a chance to increase the omega-3. Somebody comes out saying it absolutely doesn't work or whatever. Uh, I, I'll accept that and quit using it maybe. But then every, all you people out there that use flax uh, for your own health, you probably will stop taking it too, I'm sure.